Seven First Nations reside in the province of Saskatchewan. PGA Tour Canada players Evan Harmeling and Jordan Waller got to learn more about the indigenous history of the area at Wanuskewin Heritage Park, a Northern Plains Indians cultural interpretive center. How are we doing? Gentlemen. Jordan. Ernie Walker's mine. How are you doing, Evan? Yes, sir. Nice to meet you. So you good ready to go for a walk? Yeah, absolutely. absolutely. Gonna get muddy. I'm gonna get muddy? <laughs> Those better not be your pro shoes. No, no, they're not. Okay. No, they're not. <laughs> this is gonna be the only park in North America where we have live buffalo running around. It's uh, pretty darn unique. So you're here uh, at the very special time. After a hike up the plains, the players got a chance to see some of the archaeological artifacts from the area. Well, gentlemen, these are teepees. This is pretty cool. The inside of a teepee. That's shards of buffalo bone. Really? There's a piece of a tooth. This is a piece of a buffalo tooth. Jordan Thunderchild performs traditional dances at the park. He showed the players some of the rituals of the Northern Plains. So this is a uh, men's grass dance. This is one of the many styles for a powwow. Grass dance was actually based on the scouts. They would be the ones who would go ahead of all their tribe and they would find out where, you know, was a good spot where they could set up camp. And the reason they were sent out too is so they could bless the ground because uh, it's also a healing dance. When we dance, we dance to mimic the grass as well. So, you know, we always move in a swaying manner like that. Mm -hmm. And sometimes we'll look off balance. Next, it was time for Harmeling and Waller to give it a try. Okay, so it's a more, like, uh, you know, constant beat. Mm -hmm. So you can just start by, you know, tapping your foot. And then when you dance, you always do the same thing with the other side. <laughs> oh, <yeah. Tired? laughs> That's good stuff, man. That's fun. Yeah, it was fun having Ernie guide us around there. He was really nice and cares a lot about the land. You can, you can tell how much he appreciates everything. And then the dancing, definitely like watching Jordan better than making a fool out of myself. But it was, it was a lot of fun. It was a great experience. I really didn't think I'd be getting the opportunity to go out here and in the plains and look at, you know, buffalo bone and, and all these different artifacts that Ernie was showing us is really, I mean, a really cool experience. Wish I had a little more time to go out and, and tour around and maybe dig a little myself. <laughs>